<laughs> Welcome to Athletes in Action. I'm Wiley Baker. As we continue traveling around Anne Arundel County, we stop by the Arnold Way, the maroon and gray of Broadneck High School, visiting with the Bruin cheerleading squad and head coach Chrissy Albright. Go to the very beginning of the routine. Coach Albright is anxious about her girls' outlook this season. This year we have 17 girls competing on the floor, um, all the way from freshmen to seniors. The co-captains have a good feeling that their squad will have a successful season. We have a new routine, new people, and I'm just, I'm happy to get on the mat with everyone new. I love my team. We're really close together and we've been that way since my freshman year. Um, since I'm a senior, yeah, now the people that I started off my freshman year with aren't here anymore, but I get to see the team progress and I get to see the new people that are going to take my place when I'm gone. So it's really enlightening to see all that. Staying at a high competitive level means one thing for sure. They have the same practice regimen every day. We start with warming up and then we run through sections of the routine at a time to music. And at the end of practice, we try our best to go full out, which is beginning to end, doing all their stunts, jumps, and tumbling. Staying physically fit is a must. Coming to practice, some of us work out outside of school, but just coming to practice keeps them in pretty good shape. We work hard here. It's practice, practice, practicing, and we all pretty much have like experience with everyone, so it's good to like, it's fun to work together. Amongst that, staying on top of grades is a big team focal point. I communicate with their teachers a lot to make sure their grades are above a 2.0 because in cheerleading, if you lose somebody off your team, you have to redo everything. We just don't have bench players, so it's very difficult if we lose somebody, so we stay on top of their grades. Being a solid, kind-hearted role model before, during, and after competitions is key. They come to me a lot, actually, um, during practices. They'll ask me what classes to take next year. Even as small as, can you help me with this math problem? Um, anything like that. I see the difference that it makes in the girls, and it really motivates them. We all try to help each other. We um, ask people if they need help in like, math and different subjects. And we'll like, stay after as being captains, like help people with homework and things like that. Some of us stay after school to take tests, to do homework. Some of us hang out after school with each other to do homework with each other. So that keeps our grades up. Strong captains lead to a strong team in all facets. You know, well, a lot of the people that led me my freshman year were really powerful, and the thing I remember most is how they encouraged me on things that I was a little unsure about. So as a captain, I try to really make sure that I do the same thing. Well, our team's kind of like a family. Like, we have struggles and everything, and we just come into practice and do what we're supposed to do, and we take care of each other. Striving to be the best is the Bruins' goal. For us to just have a good season, we don't have to win, but just have a good season and everyone like stay healthy and we all are able to make it states. I'm looking forward to taking home a victory senior year. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Wiley Baker. I'll talk to you on the court, on the field, or on the air with more of Anne Arundel County Public Schools Athletes in Action.